Hello and welcome to this edition of Take the Fear Out the Gear with me, Mr. Chumley Warner. Me, Jason Bangers. How do you do, Tubes? What we have here right now for you is the Roland FP3. Now this is what's known as a stage piano. Why are they called stage pianos, sorry? Well, my guess would be because everyone uses them on stage. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so they're more they're more set for the professional market then I guess they're for composers and stage work, rock and roll bands, musicals, for the theatres. And if so, yeah, if you wanted if you wanted one in your studio, you haven't got room for a piano. This is what you'd have, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what. Without further ado, let's see what it sounds like. Uh, we've got a demo ready to play them, have we? Yep. Let's go for it, dude. Don't. <laughs> These demos, what they do, tubes, they give you an example of what's capable on them, right? So obviously it introduces different sounds. Obviously there we've got some Mickey Mouse saxophone, we've got some pads, we had some keyboard. Um, Very nice piano. Well, the piano sound on this thing I just don't think can be beaten, to be honest with you. And you had all those vocal scat sounds as well. Yeah, now, yeah, well we can show you those, I think. Ba -do. And you can get different sounds from hitting the keys differently, for example. It's just it's so quirky, man. I could play with it all day. Well, I did, didn't I, till three o'clock this morning? Yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, piano is so easy. You just hit piano and, um, I don't know, it's on too, but... Uh I've always wanted a weighted p a piano, right? Okay, so the muscle memory. I want to learn it. I want to. I want to learn to. Um, you know, I'm struggling with that. So that's what I want to learn, so And I've always wanted to be able to play the piano. I had a tattoo once, and I said to the tattoo, "That's really painful. That's really sore." He said, "Well, it will be." I said, "Well, will I be able to play piano at night?" He said, "Cause you can." Well, I went home and got on a piano. I still couldn't play it, and I was a bit, you know. Anyway, I'd like to thank Louise. Louise, thank you, sweetheart, for, for this. And um, here it is being reviewed. So uh, I think it's now time for... Tubers and Groovers. Chumley Stats. Let's go for it then, shall we? Let's just give you a few stats. Well, it's a Roland FP3. Piano. Piano. Piano, yes. Uh, as Jay said, it's got a hammer action keyboard, so it's just like a real piano. And can I tell you something as well? Yeah. They're slightly lighter up the top, apparently. Yeah, so I've slightly heard. Slightly lighter. Yeah. Only a fraction, though, because I can't really tell the difference, personally. No, I couldn't. So with a full-size keyboard, you get 88 notes. 
All the piano sounds are derived from the top model, which was the F9 at the time. Uh, I should say it came out, we reckon, in around 2000. Mm, 20 years old. So it's quite old. Uh, you've also got a three-track recorder, so you can record three tracks of parts. It's got built-in reverb, chorus, rotary effects. <laughs> uh, apparently, you can get an optional stand, which you obviously you put it on, and the stand's got like a shelf for speakers. Oh, really? So if you wanted to set it up with like it is now on, on, on the stand with speakers, apparently the speakers are, are the uh, Roland MA8 that sort of sit behind it. It'd be interesting. I'll have to have a look out for one of those there stands. And the main thing is, it's 18.5 kilos. It weighs a ton. Uh, but that kind of just that wraps it up. But price-wise, uh, originally... Th- over over two thousand pounds. Yeah, I've actually got the tax on my phone. I think she paid about two thousand four hundred for it. I think it was something like that. Uh, now you can pick them up. We've checked eBay. They're about I don't know two fifty three hundred. Yeah, I, I got a bargain, and I appreciate that, Louise. Thank you, but it's going a very good home. I shall love it, look after it, and play it forever. Um, yeah, I did get I did get a bargain. It does need a few little tweaks. It needs, yeah. a, needs, a, needs a bit of a service on these buttons here. Uh, yeah, some sticky buttons, they don't want to work very so well. So that, 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 that needs doing, but apart from that, it's absolutely wonderful. Yeah, Fantastic the, uh, keyboard. The action's great. I mean, all that remains really is the sounds. Just to show you that you can play along to it if you want to as well. <laughs> That's just us mucking around with a um, with a play along to a demo. Um, we weren't actually playing anything, but you know you could sort of, you could do that in a pub, couldn't you? You could. You know what I mean? Um, well, there's a play along, isn't there, on this thing? So um, as you can see here on the seven D, um, I'm not quite sure how to set it up, but we ended up. You got to split the. The uh, what's the names is keyboard and you you got drums and rhythm and red and then you're away aren't you? Yeah, that's right. And I think that was chord I hit to get it to go into this mode. Because if you hit drums, the drums just start. So if I press down, if we go, well, it's not middle C, but it's C. So if I just hit a C here, we get a drum intro. So you get the idea, right? I can't play piano, but I'm only mucking around anyway. But you can have bags of fun with that, and there's a lot of different um, backing tracks, as it were. Yeah, You've got a shuffle from 16, yeah. 6 yeah. eights, four fours, 60 different rhythms. So just one more, so just one more, so just one more thing. Oh, just one more thing. Just one more thing. Just one more thing. One more thing. Obviously, you in in all the things on the back there, you've got your outputs, you've got your headphones on the front, you've got your MIDI. Uh, plus, you can also plug in two piano type pedals. Yes. So, so you can set all those up. Which I was very lucky enough to get Pro- proper style piano. Yeah, so. Only latching, non latching. So, you've got all that as well. Got some great Hammond organs on it as well. And I think to get your. Uh, I think you hit the chorus to get um, like your rotator. A 
as you can see I'm learning but that's a ton of love dial of straights and there's a few Hammond organ sounds there but some real real quirky stuff you got drums you got I think you've even got the the helicopter on here believe it or not somewhere there's loads of different things and yeah. there's loads of percussion on there as well there really is so now I've got a nice weighted piano which I can trigger any sound with plug it straight into my computer into reason and actually use the sounds that are on there because they're all very usable as well so it's an awesome piece of kit and if you're looking for a master keyboard then that's the one to go for and it's certainly well made isn't it it is like yeah. a brick house isn't it <laughs> like you say and it's got the option of all the one of the best piano sounds i've heard it's amazing yeah it's good and and it's kind of gold in color it looks silver but it's kind of like a rose gold so ladies and gentlemen choovers and groovers hope you've enjoyed the show everyone Stay safe out there. Look after yourselves. Like and subscribe. From me, Jason Bangers, goodbye. And from me, Mr. Jumley Warner, goodbye. <laughs>